Okay, so say you have a text document with some file paths in it, and you just want to get a quick look at what those files are. Um, one way you can do it is to go here and kill, and then make it into the find file, and then go and check it out and see what it is, and then kill it, and then go back. Uh, but that's a lot of key presses. So uh, this is where link hint preview comes in. If you call this function link hint preview, um, it uses the link hint package to put a indicator uh, for key press. And you click it, and then it pops up a frame. Uh, and it's just a normal normal frame, but it, it opens up in read-only mode uh, because it's just for a quick preview. Um, and then if you hit Q, closes it and returns you back to where you were, and it also uh, kills the buffer, so it doesn't populate your buffer list with uh, everything that you've done a quick look at. So um, you can open up any text file that you want. And then uh, if you're in a preview buffer, you can also call the same thing and it'll open up a new one and you can just scroll through, get a good read and hit Q to go back do it again and Q to close it, Q to close it and you're back. Uh, so as you saw, it works in uh, on regular file paths, just text file paths, uh, and it also works on, on org links as, as well, like, like that. Uh, it's really helpful if you have, uh, if you use like a note-taking package, uh, for example, like my, uh, my package called uh, ZK, which um, has a lot of links to notes like this. Um, very often I want to just take a look and see what is in a file and um, just get a quick look. Uh, so this is really, really useful for that. Um, and that's pretty much the, the gist of it. So uh, if it's helpful, if you think this might be helpful to you, take a look and see what you think. And if you have any suggestions for improvement or um, any kind of additional customizations, uh, other than uh, kind of one customization is the, the frame parameters here. Uh, but, um, you know, any other extensions uh, that might be useful, I'd be interested to hear. So thanks for, thanks for stopping by.